Well, the Batman was the curiousest man about always betting on anything that turned up that you ever see. One day a feller, a stranger in Gotham he was, come across the Batman and says, What might it be that you've got in the box? And the Batman, he says, sort of indifferent like, It might be a parrot, or it might be a canary. Maybe, but it ain't. It's only just a frog. Hmm. So it is. Well, what's he good for? Well, he's good enough for one thing I should judge. He can outjump any frog in Gotham City. Well, I don't see no points about that frog that's any better than any other frog. Maybe you don't. Maybe you understand frogs. And maybe you don't understand them. Maybe you've had experience. And maybe you ain't only an amateur, as it were. Anyways, I've got my opinion, and I'm willing to risk forty dollars to can help jump any frog in Gotham City. Well, that stranger looked mighty sad, mighty sorrowful, grieved, and he said, "Well, I'm only a stranger here in Gotham, and I ain't got no frog. But if I had a frog, I'd bet you." That's all right. Just you hold my box for a minute and I'll come get you one. And so the feller took the box, put up his forty dollars along with the Batman's and sat down to wait. Well, he sat and sat and sat the longest time. At last he got Jason Todd out of the box and, well, That man, he flopped around in the swamp about half an hour. Finally, he caught a frog and fetched him to this fella. Now let the new frog down to the ground with his forepaws just even with Jason, and I'll give the word. One, two, three, scoot. Well, I don't see no points about that frog that's better than any other frog. And then the Batman see how it was. He was the maddest Batman. He took after that fella, but he never kissed.